so hello guys uh, welcome to my video so if you are a digital marketer or if you are into digital marketing you must be wondering what are the kinds of apps that you need on your mobile devices so uh, basically uh, if you are a digital marketer you uh, must uh, use different kinds of digital platforms digital channels for your digital marketing either for your business or for the company you work so uh, depending upon your work uh, there are lots of apps lots of applications that you can use or if you haven't tried yet you can try it so uh, i'd like to begin this video by starting on this uh, uh, so-called apps that i use on my day-to-day -day basis for all my digital marketing uh, efforts or digital marketing uh, job uh, so uh, starting with uh, the first one I really like using Canva so uh, basically whenever I uh, am laying down somewhere or I'm just sitting idle I use Canva for designing some posts or creating some designs and uh, which I can easily post within minutes so for this i don't need to get uh, access to my laptop whenever i am not in mood so i can access or if i'm working on uh, my laptop canva and if i'm uh if i've done enough so sometimes i can access all my designs and drafts from my mobile device so canva is a really interesting tool that you can try uh, so i just wanted the marketers out there uh, to use this so Canva is one of them. So other one is Google Analytics. So uh, it's simple, it's easy. Uh, I love seeing my uh, data uh, in summary. So basically, I get on the updates on progress. So since the mobile apps provide much more uh, uh, data in summary, so it'll be easier for us to you know sometimes figure out what we want to do. So Google Analytics, another one. So if I go to the one, it's Facebook. Obviously, everybody needs Facebook. Everyone uses Facebook. So Facebook is one of the uh, tools that I use, or most, uh, maybe all the markets out there probably use Facebook. So apart from Facebook, there's Meta Ads. So this is uh, basically for running Facebook ads or uh, running your campaigns, Facebook campaigns, analyzing your campaigns, optimizing your campaigns. So Facebook ads or Meta ads is what you need. So I have this Zoom. Uh, so whatever I uh, need some urgent meetings with my clients or uh, if I um, uh, need to call any of my clients or have a quick meetings, Zoom is always there. So uh, the social media marketing tool is LinkedIn. So yeah, so I use LinkedIn as well. So most of the marketers, uh, you also uh, be using LinkedIn. So, I don't use Google ads, so you can probably, uh, if you're running Google Ads, uh, you can probably check on quickly uh, what your campaigns are, what your campaign met metrics are, or you can quickly optimize it. So as a digital marketer, you must be creative. You are creative. You should be creative. And whenever you uh, think of something creative, you whenever you think of like some new ideas it might come um, uh, in the middle of nowhere it might come during uh, your sleep time or it might come during your break so uh, at that point of time you can simply quickly run over to your uh, Google Ads or any other uh, media social media and you can simply edit or optimize your campaigns so Google Ads is under one similarly there are other tools like messenger uh, which I use for communicating uh, uh, with customers which who sends me inquiries so otherwise Pinterest I love uh, checking my uh, company's Pinterest updates I like keeping track of the views impressions so what's happening basically we use it for communicating with our clients so Instagram is there so it's obvious it's for handling social medias so Quora is there so whenever, whenever I uh, feel like working on some ACO stuff Whenever I feel like working on some things that uh, I feel uh, like putting effort for ACO, I use Quora. So Quora is ready. So if I come across some uh, good forums where which brings value uh, to my ACO 
starting with this effort are you ready so skype is another one so which is used for communication slack is another one which is used for communication so snapchat is there so snapchat you can use either use for your business purpose or your personal purpose so snapchat i have been doing snapchat marketing for quite a while now so i use snapchat as well so apart from that there's start counter which you can call connect with your uh, website and see the uh, website analytics see the traffic status the other one is Tumblr it's a really interesting app it's a really interesting tool I got locked out because I need to log in every time uh, I opened Tumblr so Tumblr is a great platform for blogging it's great for SEO so Tumblr is there so Twitter so most of you are familiar if you are into social media you will be using Twitter so Viber is the tool that we use for communicating. So Story Art is there. So it's basically uh, for creating mockups. It's uh, for creating design, just like Canva, but it's um, more uh, minimal. So you can create some interesting designs. You can create some good animations. You can get for free. So you can try this uh, uh, Story Art app and get the most out of what you are not getting in Canva. So Trello, I really love aligning my tasks. I like keeping track of my works, my uh, stuffs aligned. So uh, Trello is there. So apart from Trello, Telegram is there, which I recently use for searching anything uh, uh, required or any communication that my clients require. So Mailchimp is there. So whenever I need to track my marketing email marketing campaigns, I uh, keep it do the trackings for from Mailchimp. So finally, the other one is Google Chat, which I use for chatting with my clients. So these are some of the basic uh, <coughs> applications which are easily available on Android and iOS. So from which uh, you can, uh, you know, a life of a digital marketing gets completed. So yes, guys, uh, this is it. So if you want any other apps, or if you uh, have idea on any other app that you use for daily. Uh, purpose is uh, if you are digital marketer you can comment down below so that others can have a look or just can try so yeah uh, this set of my application collections cover uh, different digital media platforms like uh, the social media marketing uh, search engine marketing SEO email marketing graphic designing communication all right so yeah uh, this is it so apart from that there are some other tools that i also use i use whatsapp business so which is uh, really a good tool if you uh, have a, a business whatsapp or business uh, more profile on whatsapp so i have woocommerce so i have an online e-commerce business i use woocommerce so to track all my records so i have created uh, some other shortcut to my Google Drive so that I can directly access my Google Drive like here right so apart from that I use business suite which is really needed for for Facebook Facebook marketing which is really needed for uh, tracking all the Facebook page business page efforts so apart from that I really like keeping the notes so sometimes I also keep notes whenever I come across any ideas so Asama is a great project management tool. So if you haven't tried, you can try it. The mobile app is quite easy. It's quite friendly. So you can try Asana. So it's a project management tool. So finally, there's uh, TikTok. So TikTok is a must these days because it's the training social media at the moment. So Wallet is all the thing I use because I keep it re keeping record of the payments and everything I need. All the billings that I do for my clients. Yes. As an app you can try. So apart from that, there's an app which I haven't mentioned here. It's called ACO Check. So it's a quite handy application. If you are a if you are doing some ACO stuff from your mobile. So guys, if you are uh, running late for a meeting or if you haven't been able to prepare at least something before meeting your client some ACO discussion to be done you can uh, get it done quickly by this app it's called ACO by ACO Ability so yeah this is it if you are a digital marketer these are the must have tools on a mobile devices so yes please comment down below if you think 
if I miss on anything, and please subscribe.